hey, another quick video for you. Uh, I am going away. This is why I'm just narrating this quickly. What I would be doing at this time of the year with the last month of summer going into autumn. Well, start of the month, I get down my Moist and Hero. Moist is a soil wetter which acts three ways. It'll keep that water in the profile, let that water get into the profile and it'll evenly distribute throughout the lawn area and keep it nice and moist, very important in summer. And the Hero, well that is great for soil health and holding on to nutrients for the plant. When you do that application, you've got to water that in for a good 20 minutes, just a six millimetre uh, water, just to get it nice and lightly into the profile. So a couple of days after, I think it was about three days after, it was a nice day, it wasn't uh, too windy. So I've got down a nice application of launch and root builder in a tank mix. And I did 100 mil per 100 square metres of each, but that's because my lawn is used to uh, foliar fertilizers you really have to build it up over time so if you're using it for the first time 50 millimeters of each in the amount of water that you use for your area so i'm just mixing these together oh, i've already got half the water in the tank and i'll put half the water in the tank after i've put the rest of the chemicals in oh, boy. and making sure that i go through the filter basket and making sure that everything goes through the filter basket so I wash all the product into the mix. After I put it all in there, I agitate it up and give that a couple of minutes to agitate. If you've got a backpack, just give it a good stir for a little while or we'll give it a shake and you'll get the same effect. And once it's all mixed up, you take it out into the lawn and spray. So you evenly spray this area with your sprayer. I've got the BA uh, greens 75 I think it is yeah 75 litres it can hold and uh, I've got eight litres in here and I just go over my area twice it's a fantastic sprayer to just do a very quick job on this uh, now 90 meter squared lawn and you can turn it off and turn it on and when you turn it off it agitates fantastic so it's kind of a bit bulky for the area but uh, I just get to it now launch is a balanced NPK and that will give you fantastic condition to survive the heat of the summer and it's also a great conditioning fertiliser for the winter months as well. And Root Builder, well that is Australia's best kelp for roots, um, it's been proven so no problems there and that will extend the root system and bigger root system and a healthier root system means a more resilient plant. Okay so if you have a lawn that's in bad condition or you know this lawn here was a bit bumpy it's never been renovated before or you've got a bit of a thatch build up you'd probably be looking at a height reset before autumn to get rid of the thatch or a dethatch or even a full reno what i'm doing here you can do renos at this time of the year no problems because there's still a lot of heat around and even going into autumn i've renoed as late as uh like the third week in March and uh, you can still get away with it because there's a whole bunch of energy. So it's great to have my Waybang uh, mower back here and as you can see even though this is a very powerful mower it does struggle from time to time getting down so it's many many mows over over and over again and then slightly lowering it and you know it clogged up a few times because yeah look at this it's just an immense amount of uh, clippings. That's for sure. This small area, 40 square meters, it did two bins. It's completely amazing. So after I've just gone that uh, down with the uh, rotary, and I didn't do a dethatch or anything like that, I've done a core aerate. So that aerating will get the air, water, and nutrients into the profile and to the lawn a lot easier. And what that will do for the lawn is it will really help it establish a better root system because it's got that air, water and nutrients flowing around and it comes back, it's a lot better. So the next is top dress. I borrowed some uh, of Mick, uh, my mate that I did uh, the lawn for and uh, when I did my lawn out the front. And um, yeah, this is just 821 from Hydrix. It's a blended loam and I didn't quite get enough. So I went down to Hydrix uh, and got some more and uh, so it took up a whole ton basically thereabouts and 
just got that out there in little piles and then used the landscapers rake to spread it out just that little bit and did all of those and then after that got the soil leveler out and just evened it out uh, a fair bit more it takes a bit of time but it's actually really quite a quick process once you get into it mind you the day that i was doing this it was absolutely hugely hot this is a 40 degree temperature that i'm doing it in and i was just completely dying so that's why i waited to the late afternoon and the shade but yeah got stuck into that no problems and this was really rutted and everything it hadn't uh, i think it went in early september just before i moved into the house and uh, when I got to it, it was about three weeks in and then I had to do lots of robotic mower uh, reviews so I didn't have a time to really uh, top dress it once it grew in uh, and it was a good test as well because those mowers especially the Luber uh, from Emotion really handled it well so went over it with the roller as you've seen and I'm using Moist and Hero again uh, 300 mils moist per the 100 square meters 100 mil hero uh, moist for soil wetting hero for soil health and holding on to the nutrients and i reckon i also put uh, well, i reckon i do i remember i only did this a few days ago i put down 50 mils of amino plus from uh folimax that's a new turf product and that's just uh, amino acid to give it some bounce straight after that I've put down the four seasons, as you know, slow release nitrogen, slow release potassium. It's also got iron in there in the mix to give a dark, deep green. Probably not the most ideal fertilizer for um, uh, bringing it back from a Renault. You probably want something with a bit more faster nitrogen than what four seasons done does. But you know, it's what I had, and it's it's fine. It's not going to be a problem at all. And a good 20 minute water to get it in. So look. Thanks for watching my video today. Like, subscribe, do all that. It's just been a... I just got told today that I have to go north for work. So it's been go, 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 go. And uh, I've just done this video very quickly uh, to help you out uh, with your rest of summer. Um, I will be gone uh, just for a week and a bit and uh, I'll be back into it. Uh, I've got a couple of quick videos like this. I think I'm going to edit up tonight and... Uh, chuck on to the uh, channel uh, hopefully uh, depending if the internet works well tonight so thanks for watching my video get your lawn on and we'll see you in the next one